Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Brooke Isabella, your favorite sister. Just kidding. We're both your favorite. Um, anyways, today I'm gonna be doing like my fingernail tutorial. Um, I did one of these on the sisters channel. You can check that out. Um, the channel is linked below. But I haven't done one on this channel and that one was like six months ago. I don't even know. But I'm gonna do a new one because I want to do a new one. Um, before we start, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Um, comment some new video ideas. Turn your post notifications to see when I upload, which is every single Wednesday. Um, and yeah, so let's just, let's get started. Alright, so if you guys did not know, um, I do these like hard kind of nails. They're like gel acrylic kind of stuff. It's like, I don't even know what it is, honestly, but it's called Gelish. That's the brand that we're going to be using. Um, so I'm going to show you everything that we're going to need. Oh my god. Okay. So, um, I've had this stuff for a couple years now. I absolutely love it. It is a little bit expensive, but they last like two weeks and they don't chip, they don't fall off. And I just, I, I really like them. So um, I use these cups because I like to take the powder and like go over it. I used to dip it in the thing, but now I'm more into using these cups. So these are just cups I found in the house or nothing special. Um, so we'll need those. Okay. And um, then the spoon, obviously, to go with that. I'll just put that in there. Then I use this brush um, to wipe off the stuff. So we got this. This is just a makeup brush that I got from like a kit that I don't use any of the brushes. So this isn't that special either. A nail file, um, nail clippers, and then whatever this thing is called to get stuff out from your nails. Then these little um cotton pad things to um take off some powder and then your colors which today i'm going to be using this blue and this sparkly one so you'll be seeing those um then we need the prep this is the prep the base coat which Okay, good, it opens. Um, yes, the base coat, it's like super glue, so like it glues together. The activator and the top coat. And then your iPad to watch YouTube videos so that you don't rush. Like I sometimes rush and they turn out really bad, but if I'm watching videos and I'm occupied and not thinking so much, then I, then I like to watch YouTube, it slows me down <laughs> and I do better. So the first thing that I need to do is I need to take off my nails. My Wi-Fi is not working, that's annoying. So I'm gonna take these off. Um, you're technically supposed to like soak them in like stuff. I have all the stuff, but I don't, I don't feel like it. Um, but these have been on for a few weeks now, so they'll be easy to come off. So I'm just gonna like peel these off and then we're gonna get started. So I'll be back in one minute, okay? All right, so the next thing I'm doing, I took them all off. They did really good. Like, um, I don't recommend peeling them off because it's not good, but they all came off really easy because they were on for a long time. So they were going to fall off soon anyways. Um, so they didn't hurt or anything. If you take them off like the day after you do them, then they hurt really bad because they're like not ready to come off. So next I'm going to cut my nails and then um, take out like any dirt, you know, and then I'm going to file them. So, that's what I'm gonna do. You can enjoy a little time lapse of me doing that and that's what's gonna happen. All right, so I finished cutting them. I have like dust all over now. Um, so you wanna make them so they're like not shiny, so you have to file them down all the way to like their 
until they're um can you see kind of like i don't even know how to explain this but um once you're like not shiny because you know like a normal nail has like a kind of like shiny look you want them to be like not shiny because then they um the glue and whatever sticks on so you have to make sure they're not shiny so then what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a layer of the prep on so this layer it's just like clear stuff it just preps the nail so i'm just gonna put that on every single nail um it's pretty simple nothing really cool about it um this is only one step it's like some of these you have to put them on a couple times but this one you only use it once and then you're done so i'm just gonna put this on quick almost done it's really simple Um, so the next thing I'm gonna do is this is where like the coloring starts like I'm doing all blue and then on uh, I think I'm gonna do this finger my ring finger um, I'm just gonna put a little bit of sparkles on that so we're gonna start with this one though so I got my cup this is where it gets a little bit more difficult so then we're gonna put the base coat on this is, like glues together all the time it's annoying but yeah so you put the glue on, you take a little bit of stuff, you sprinkle it over and top it off. So I'm going to do that to every single one of my nails and this looks so cool, can you see it? It's like a powdery mountain, it just looks cool. Alright, so I'm going to do this, um, this part you have to be careful with, this part you have to be careful with because if you get it off your nail, um, it's gonna stay there because like you know this stuff isn't actually glue but it's like nail glue so it's like it's light glue um so like if it gets off your nail or whatever it's gonna be there and you don't want your nails to look like a mess so you want to make sure you get them on your nail and make sure you do it very precisely so that's why i'm gonna be watching youtube not rushing just taking my time because i do so much better when i take my time so i'm gonna do that and we're gonna do um, two layers of that, so. All right, so now I put on the first layer. Now I'm gonna take my brush and I'm gonna like um, brush it, the extra stuff like off into the cup. Um, I'm doing good so far. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna empty my cup back into my bowl. And I know this isn't like, like I've seen like, reviews and stuff like it's like because like i read about these before i got them they're like it's unsanitary and stuff but like i'm literally the only one who uses these if i was like working at a nail salon then obviously i would not be doing this but um literally i'm the only one using it so it doesn't really matter so now i'm going to do another layer just like i did before so this is what they look like right now um and then then we're going to wipe them off and then i'm going to put the glitter on so that's what I'm gonna do quick and and um yeah yeah yeah
Yes, okay. Next, we're gonna put our activator. Um, this is just an activator. It like activates them. Um, obviously that's what it's called. So, um, you're just gonna put that one on each of the nails. It really just brings them, brings them to life. Like it really does. This is like my favorite part, watching them just come to life. Um, told myself I'd never do this again, but I did it again. I put, um, I put my brush on the sparkles and I put it on my nail again and then my whole nail turns to sparkles and I didn't want sparkles on that nail. So, we're just gonna take off those sparkles quick. Sparkles get everywhere! That's why I don't really use them much. I used to use them a lot a while ago. Now I don't use them as much. Okay, so now that that's done, we're gonna put a layer of our base coat on again, just over all of them, and then we'll be done with our base coat. <coughs> this stuff isn't good for you to breathe in, but it's okay. Um, this, you don't have to put any um, powder on. We're done with the powder too, so. So we're done working out. But honestly, I like, I really recommend this stuff. It's like the best stuff in the world. Like you can go get your nails done at like a place, like a nail salon, and they're so expensive. But I know this stuff costs a lot of money, but it lasts me a long time and I can do them all myself. So it's fantastic. So now that that's done, we're gonna let them dry for just a couple seconds and then we're gonna file them down. I know it seems weird to file your nails after you do them because like, it'd be like taking off your nail polish. You don't wanna take it off, but this stuff is like hard. So basically we're just gonna smooth them all out. Um, sometimes you get like little bumps in there and the file really helps. I need for the new file, I need a new file. These are all old. Um, but the file really helps smooth them out. Um, and this stuff dries really fast, like they're already dry. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna file these for a little bit. So I'll be right back. All right, so I filed them all, and then we're gonna do our last layer of activator. This just really brings it together. So they're all like filed, they're kind of like dusty, but this, like, look, it's beautiful. So we're gonna put a layer of this on each nail. Muy bien. I'm loving them. This was like, no, this wasn't my first color. My first color was a bright blue like this, and like, the colors are literally like $15 each, so I only had one color to start with because I wanted to see if I liked it and stuff. I didn't want to buy like 600 colors because it's expensive. And this was like my first color and, well, it, it wasn't this one, but it was a bright blue. And it just brings back the memories of wearing bright blue every day. So now the last step, we're going to put two layers of this top coat on. So it's just, this is like another glue, so you don't want to get this everywhere either, but um, this is just what makes them hard and shiny. Like, it's just, it's beautiful. So I'm going to go put two layers of this on, and then, and then we're about done, because this is our last step. So, I love this step. Honestly, I don't really like the filing. Filing makes me like, um, what's the word? I don't know. It just makes me, it just makes me, gives me a, like a squirmy feeling. Like I don't like the feeling or the listening or just anything about filing nails. So getting this stuff, like filing was like a huge step of it. So I had to like break down that fear of files. Well, I wasn't really a fear, but I hated them. So I had to like get over it and work around it, which was difficult, but we did it. Um, so, but what was I saying? I, I like all the steps except for filing. Um, I also don't really like putting the powder on because I'm so scared I'm gonna mess up and then it's gonna look bad. But um, the top coat and the activator are my two favorites. And the prep, which is really easy, which um, 
That's honestly too easy to be my favorite. I want it a little difficult. Oh my god, they're looking so good. I haven't done a bright color in so long. They really pop. All right, so that was the last step. So now I just let them dry for like a minute and then they're good. They're so pretty. I am so happy with them. Um, I didn't even like mess up at all. So I want to say thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Um, I really recommend this stuff if you ever want to try it out. Just look it up on Amazon. Gelish um, dip stuff. You'll find it. But um, it's it's wonderful. I love it. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next week. Thank you.